Hello, and thank you for joining me for another episode of Festo's Garage. Today we're going to be putting these last fit LED headlights in this 2012 Toyota Prius V. Let's get it started. What we want to do is get the hood open. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take a 10 millimeter socket. And we're going to undo these two bolts right here, and we're going to take this coolant tank and lift it up so that we can access the back of the headlight where the bulbs are at. 10 millimeter. And take these two bolts off. Two 10 millimeter bolts out. I can lift the coolant tank up and out of the way. That'll allow me to put my hand behind here and access the bulbs. So what I can do is I can follow the wire up for the low beam bulb and I feel the bulb in the back of the housing. What I want to do is I want to turn it a quarter of a turn, then I should be able to remove it from the housing. You gotta get your hand back there and get a grip on it. There we go. Alright, and it comes out. It's attached to this wire. You got a simple little plug. Unplug it. When you're putting the new standard bulbs back in, you want to make sure that you do not touch this glass. Otherwise, it'll cause a problem with the bulb. We're putting LED bulbs in, so that shouldn't matter. Got my new LED bulbs here. I'm gonna find the one with the connector that matches, which is this. So these are our replacement bulb. Same thing for the high beam, quarter of a turn. Right, this is our high beam light. You see the difference between those? You know, you got the right one. You look at the connectors. Same. Once we've got them both plugged in, I'm going to turn the headlights on and make sure they work. Alright, you can see the difference. Those are the new LED lights, the high beam and the low beam. And this is the colors of the original. See how it's kind of yellowy. And of course the low beam is out on this side. But that's a big difference right there. From that kind of high beam color to that kind of high beam color. That's a big difference. Right, we've got the bulbs in and we know that they're working. We'll go ahead and put these two bolts back in for our coolant tank. Now there's a little rubber stopper down here and a pin on the bottom of the tank. You got to make sure you line that up in the hole and then it'll go into place. The front mount up here has got a little bit of a flex to it. So you put that bolt in first, okay? Then you can push this whole coolant tank around to align the back bolt. Don't tighten either one of them up until you've got them both started. With that headlight on, I can hear the little fan running in the background behind the headlight bulbs. The driver's cool. side headlight is a little bit easier to do. You don't have to worry about taking anything out of the way. You just got to fish your hand behind there and pop each one of the bulbs out, disconnect them, put the new bulbs in, and connect them. So it's just a matter of uh, getting your hand back there. Ain't nobody going to want none of that. Now what we gotta do is wait for it to get dark and we'll adjust the beams to where they don't blind other drivers. All right, we're in the car. We've got the headlights adjusted. I got my driver here. And she is going to check out her headlights for the first time. Go ahead and check them out. Woo, that's bright. change the headlights in a Toyota Prius V 2012. If you found it educational and entertaining, please click the thumbs up button, the like button. 
If you haven't done so already, please click the subscribe button. Subscribe to the channel. You'll see more videos of working on cars, unboxing videos, deer videos, some videos of our dogs, all kinds of good stuff maybe. Who knows? You'll have to go check it out and judge for yourself. Well, thank you for watching. Until next time, Greg Festo out.